President Joe Biden now moving forward with his pandemic plan as the state of Wisconsin sees frustration in its vaccine rollout. Our team does have you covered. First, let's get over to News 9's Phil Aldridge with the latest from Washington. Phil. Melissa, President Joe Biden signed at least 10 executive orders and directives today focused on COVID-19, saying we're in a national emergency. The orders ramped up supplies for vaccinations, testing, personal protective equipment, and to boost development of treatments. President Biden is also directing the Federal Emergency Management Agency, FEMA, to reimburse states for the cost of National Guard personnel and emergency supplies. Our national plan launches a full-scale wartime effort to address the supply shortages by ramping up production and protective equipment, syringes, needles, you name it. Emphasizing the need to wear masks, President Biden is requiring facial coverings in airports and on interstate trains and buses, saying, quote, they are even more important than the vaccines. This week marks the one-year anniversary since COVID-19 was first detected in the United States. As of today, more than 408,000 Americans have died from the virus, Melissa. 